Hi, I'm Journal of Commerce staff writer Russell Hickson, and here's a look at the 2016 federal budget. Overall, the government proposes $120 billion in infrastructure spending over two phases. The first phase consists of $11.9 billion earmarked for green, social, and transit infrastructure. The government will also focus on municipal capacity building and water projects with an emphasis on First Nations communities. $3.4 billion is planned for social infrastructure, with $2.3 billion allocated over two years for affordable housing. $85.4 million is also planned over the next five years to develop a new framework for union-based apprenticeship training. An additional $150 million will be allocated to labor market development agreements, along with $50 million in 2016 and 2017 for the Canada Job Fund agreements. The Liberals are also putting $3.4 billion into public transit programs, as this funding is based on share of national ridership, Ontario, Quebec, and British Columbia will get the majority of the funds. $3.5 billion is going to infrastructure in First Nations communities over the next five years, including $1.8 billion for wastewater treatment and clean drinking water, and $732 million over two years to address housing needs in northern communities. For more budget coverage and analysis, go to dailycommercialnews.com and journalofcommerce.com.